Good morning, family. Good morning, good morning. Praise the Lord. This is the day that the Lord has made. We come to rejoice and to be glad in it. Good morning, everyone. Good morning. Thank you for coming on. We certainly welcome you. We're excited about today. Amen. New day, new mercies, new joys, new breakthroughs, new suddenlies. Amen. Good new opportunities. Hallelujah. New visions, new dreams. It's a new day. It's a new day. A day we've never seen before. God bless you. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Hey, big sis. <laughs> Amen. Prophet good. Michelle McLean Walters. Oh, good morning. Good Hallelujah. morning, sweetheart. Blessings. The wealthy Bless place. Yes, Hallelujah. absolutely. Absolutely. Amen. God is doing oh, some great things. Amen. Thank you so much for coming on. Thank you for sharing. As you come, please share, invite the followers. Amen. Invite your family. Please share on Facebook as well as Periscope. Thank you all so very yes. much. She has well, she has the Esther anointing. She has the Deborah anointing. Yes. Uh, she has um, the me prophetic out. advantage. The prophetic advantage. Mm -hmm. Amen. Yes, please. And uh, where can they get those books at, Prophet Michelle? Amen. You certainly go to um, her website. Anna well. Anointing. Okay, the yeah, Anna Anointing, Anointing, the Deborah Anointing. That's right, and the Esther Anointing. Mm -hmm. And so go, yes. you guys go to her website. Make sure you, you pick up those books. It will bless you. I promise mm -hmm. you it will bless you. Amen. Hallelujah. Yes, yes. There's some Deborahs on here, some Annas on here. Amen. Yes, yes. It's time to arise. It's time to come forth. It's time to walk in purpose and fulfill the call of God that is upon your life. Amen. Prophetess Michelle McLean does an amazing job. She has such a heart, um, not only for women, but for people in general to really come forth and to be all that God has called them to be. Amen. Amen. We are excited. We are excited. I tell you, uh, God continues to outdo himself. Amen. We always say that God doesn't duplicate himself. He exceeds himself. And many times we think God is going to do it like the last time. Let me tell you, you're in for a complete surprise because God is doing something that you haven't seen before. Amen. He's doing it suddenly. He's doing it straightway. He's doing it immediately. And he's doing it without notice. He's not letting people know. He's moving by his power and by his spirit. Amen. And it's, it's, it's your day. It's your time. It's your season um, for the word of God to manifest in your life. Hallelujah. We are excited. Man, this has been an amazing. Last week was an amazing, amazing week. And I tell you, the testimonies keep coming. They keep, God keeps uh, doing great things. Amen. Amen. God bless you. God bless you from Pennsylvania. God bless you. Let us know if you are a first timer. We certainly love to welcome all of our first timers. Amen. You need a, okay. Yes. Yes. Suddenly to finish your book. It's coming. Yes. This is the time. This is the hour, the moment um, for you to finish. Amen. God has released a finisher's anointing upon you. God bless you, Jackie. God bless you, Prophetess Tammy. Uh, my dear sister, blessings to you all as well from all around the world. Amen. From far and near, the, the heart of God is represented here um, on this morning. Many hearts are going forth, different colors representing different anointings. Amen. Different graces <coughs> on this morning. Yes. Yes. Hallelujah. You know, I was I was uh, I was ministering today, and as I was looking at the text, uh, I saw a certain scripture there in Psalm 68, and I'm going to deal with that in a minute. Thank you guys for sharing. Thank you so many of you for being on. We love you guys, and uh, we bless you. Yeah, we're praying that God would fill our cup. I really felt that that was a uh, a song that was uh, that's right on time Absolutely. and right in place Absolutely. for what we're going to talk about yes. tonight. And again, if you would share, those of you who have not shared, God bless you. We are yes. so excited for you to be here. 
Uh, so excited to be able to come to you again this morning, and uh, we thank you for your prayers. You guys have been praying. You guys have been standing with us. Uh, so excited about all, everybody that joined the group uh, on Facebook and seeing just uh, just the amazing, the amazing testimonies, amen, and all the prayer requests, and uh, we continue to pray for those and yes. believe God for those. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You guys are so, uh, so amazing, amen. I'm looking at Psalm 68, and there were two scriptures that came that I really dealt with, um, and I'm waiting on a few more people to come on, but thank you guys for sharing. Yes. Thank you for sharing on Facebook Live, so we, of course, do Facebook Live and also um, receive the Value Recognition Award on the job, uh, suddenly, amen. Wow, praise Look God. Look at God, won't praise he do God. it? God, that's one of the things that we have been praying and that God was going to do because in one day, I think it was about three, at least three, if not four people received an unexpected check in the mail from a former employee all on the same day. Wow. You know, they testified of that and just amazing. And, and, and your blessings, you're not going to have to look for your blessings. They're going to find you. Mm -hmm. No matter if you move, you're in a different state, you're in a different country, your blessings will find you because God knows exactly where you are. Hmm. Yes. 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 I'm looking at this text. Amen. And uh, so what we talked about today, let me give you a recap really quickly of what we talked about today, why people are still coming on. Uh, we were looking at a text of scripture that came out of Psalm 68 and it basically said, let God arise, let his enemies be scattered and let them also that hate him flee before him. Mm. And we began to talk about in the Old Testament how some of the uh, enemies of God, amen, were the Amalekites and the Egyptians and of course the Midianites and the Syrians, Philistines. Edomites, uh, mm -hmm. Amorites, and all those different groups of people. Then we looked at Exodus 23 and 22, where God says that his enemies, that our enemies became the enemies of God. And so right. we have to look at that and realize that there are going to be times we're not going to have to fight in the battle. God's going to deal with the enemies for us. Yes. And so when I began to look at the text, and I said in the New Testament, though, some of the enemies of God, amen, uh, is, is the carnal mind. Mm. But what I found that I was most interested in and I thought was really exciting was in Psalm 68, after his enemies were scattered, mm -hmm. then down in verse number 8, it said, The earth shook, the heavens also dropped at the presence of God. And so when it, when it begins to talk about the heavens dropping, then I begin to look at this word about drop. And so mm -hmm. when I begin to look at look up the word drop in scripture, yes. I begin to see many times, amen, where God would say, uh, but like uh, Job, 20, I mean, Job, Job 36 and 28, it mm -hmm. said, Which the heavens do drop and to steal upon man... Uh, um, abundantly and then psalm 65 and 12 amen they said they drop upon the pastures of the wilderness and uh and then he goes on to say for the okay let's say uh let me see where, where's another one um the, which, which one did you say okay here we go isaiah 45 and 8 drop down ye heavens from above and let the skies pour down righteousness and let the earth open up and let them bring forth salvation and let righteousness bring forth, spring up together i the lord have created it mm -hmm. and so when we begin to see yes. uh and matter of fact and it uh joel, joel 3 and 18 and it shall come to pass in that day that the mountains shall drop down new wine and the hills shall flow with milk and all the rivers of judah shall flow with waters and a fountain shall come forth of the house of the lord and shall water the valley of shittim and then it goes on to say amen so so we begin to see different places where the mountains begin to drop sweet wine and god will begin Jesus. to drop things and so our declaration was let the heavens open and let it drop upon us amen yes. this is our suddenly season mm -hmm. and we're praying that god will begin to yes. drop amen that, that the heavens would open mm -hmm. and god would begin to drop his blessings and his favor and his increase and he would begin to drop things upon you that everything that you have need of as the heavens open that God will begin to drop it upon you and so that was our yes. declaration today amen if we would get to a place that all of the enemies mm -hmm. amen of God are scattered in our lives and even some personal things that we have even the carnal mind because the carnal mind it, the, the Bible says is enmity against God right. and so we got to deal with our carnal mind but once we've dealt with that amen and that enemy of God the carnal mind has been scattered we're going to begin to see God open up the heavens yes. and begin to drop the dew amen and drop provision and yes. drop favor and drop many other things from heaven and so that's our prayer tonight as we begin to pray tonight we're going to begin to pray that God would cause the heavens to open and for yes. them to drop upon us even on tonight amen and even upon your lives amen that the dew of heaven would begin Jesus. to drop uh, would begin to drop upon you amen that favor would mm. begin to open and drop upon
upon you. Amen. Yes. That everything that pertains to you would be blessed. Amen. Everything that pertains to you, amen, would, 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 would just begin to overflow. Yes. Amen. We yes. were looking at Psalm uh, 68 and verse 8. Amen. The earth shook, the heavens also mm. dropped at the presence of God. And even as we got Jesus. into the presence of God today, we began yes. to see God dropping the, you know, the dew of his presence, the mm. dew of the anointing of God. And I mean, just amazing things begin to happen. Yes. And I believe that even on this scope, even those that will watch the scope afterwards, our declaration yes. is that God is opening up the, the even the heavens for you mm. and causing it to drop. Amen. Yes, your inheritance, amen, is being released. Amen. Everything that's been held Jesus. up, even as the heavens are open over your life, yes. that it, it, as the heavens are open and the dew of God begins to drop, amen, and the mountains drop and the sky drops mm. upon you, you're going to begin to see amazing things begin to happen. Amen. Yes. How many people are ready, amen, for the heavens to open, amen, and for God to begin to drop things upon you, amen, to drop his favor, yes. drop his blessings, drop, yes. amen, his glory, drop his presence, amen, and, 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 and drop things upon you, even things that have been held up, amen, yes. drop, amen, even, even relationships, amen, that God is causing them to come back together. When the favor of God comes and when the glory mm. of God comes, it literally begins to change things. It begins to transition things Jesus. on our behalf, amen. So uh, we're going to begin, yes, new songs, amen, come out of the heavenlies and new songs open up, amen. They yes. even open up even more. And so just amazing things that God is doing. And even as, even as uh, Amber was just saying, even in the service today, they begin begin to, amen, just sing new songs and worship yes. with new songs, yes. amen, and then new prophetic words begin to come forth. Something happened that doesn't always happen, amen. One of the uh, leaders began to go up and prophesy. She began to prophesy. People just began to go to the altar and right. just weep before God, and so I believe yes. that God is causing things, amen, to come into your life. Yes, mm -hmm. gifts are stirred up, amen. Business is beginning to prosper. Mm -hmm. Your ministry is prosper. Everything is going to be blessed yes. when God begins to open the heavens and drop over your life, amen. Yes, amen. Yes. Everything thing that you need. Release that one word suddenly. Amen. That, that was what it was yes. for us. When the heavens opened and we were in that open heaven environment, all of a yes. sudden, amen, God began to drop over our lives and amazing things began to happen. Amen. Yes. And one of the things that many of you say, well, how do I do that? How does that happen? What's the process and what do I need to do in order for the heavens to open, in order for um, the heavens to drop upon me? One of the things that we, we found even on today, it was unity, coming together on one accord, um, honoring God. God, lifting him up, magnifying him, praising him, coming to a place that we lay everything everything else aside and we seek God with all of our heart and all of our mind. We also see that even God will open up the windows of heaven over us if we're obedient to him. He's a covenant God coming into covenant um, with, with an almighty God, releasing and blessing the Lord with the first of all that God has blessed you with. Amen. That you don't rob him, that you don't take from him, that you don't steal from him, but you honor him and by giving him the first and honoring him. He said, if you do these things, if you honor me and give me what belongs to me and offer a, a, a offering up unto me, noting my worth to you, letting me know how much you appreciate me, my giving to me, I will open up the windows of heaven over you and pour you out a blessing that you won't even have room enough to receive. So we ourselves can do some things as we get into alignment with God, as we honor his word, as we're obedient to him, that we can come together on one accord. Something happens when there when, when we work, uh, worship God corporately something happens when we come together even as you all come on there is such a strength there is an anointing that that takes place that God releases when we come together because you're coming because you're hungry for God you're desperate for him many of you um, midnight is something that you know you don't necessarily you're not up this time of morning but there is something on the inside of you that won't let you sleep sometimes it's your alarm that wakes you up but many times as God is saying it's time to get up. It's time to cry out. It's time to come together on one accord and something happens. There is something when you can worship God by yourself, but there is another thing when you worship God corporately, then he releases a corporate anointing on your life. Amen. So we have the ability as we come together, as we're going to begin to pray that God is going to open up the heavens and they're going to drop upon us. Suddenlies are going to drop. Breakthroughs are going to drop. Deliverance is going to drop. Amen. Restoration and reconciliation is going to drop upon your life. Hallelujah. Amen. Well, let us pray. Amen. As we're praying, 
put the areas up on the screen that you want God to begin to um, yes. we, 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 that you be, that you want God to begin to drop for you amen the areas in your life whether it's uh, a relationship whether it's finances whether it's your business whether it's your ministry whether it's your church whatever it is that you need God to do for you amen I want you to begin to put that on the screen so that we can begin to call those things Jesus. out and pray and thank you for those that have shared already thank you for those that are giving hearts thank you for those that are sharing on Facebook live because as we pray we want to believe God for amazing things for you and for yes. your life and for your family for your ministry amen and even as you're putting it up the other intercessors are praying other intercessors are decreeing other yes. intercessors are declaring and so father we just thank you tonight even Jesus. these that are putting these yes. things on there that god even as the heavens oh, are dropping yeah. oh god over their lives oh heavenly father that their families and their marriages god and their relationships god and their finances oh god that you're opening up the windows of heaven and pouring out blessings upon them that they'd have not room enough to receive god even for their ministries even for their children god debt free god and and and, and god others that need uh, marriage situations, oh Heavenly Father, business situations, God, wholeness in their lives, will, uh, wisdom, God, for their health, oh God, yes. people need a new job, a new place to live, God, reunion with their family. Father, we pray now, God, that even as your, uh, as your, as your heavens open over them, oh Heavenly um, God, you begin to drop down upon them, God, even as the heavens begin to drop, God, yes. that you cause them, oh Heavenly Father, oh God, to answer every prayer, every prayer that people are praying tonight, God, everything that your people stand in the need of, Jesus. God, we declare, Lord God, that we come together on one accord in your mm. word declares that where two of us should touch and agree concerning the things that we ask God that we'll have the petition we ask for so we stand yes. in agreement with your yes. word we stand in yes. agreement oh God with your plan my for God. our lives oh God, God in the name of Jesus we thank you God that you're moving now by your power and by your spirit in the name of Jesus God we decree and we Jesus. declare God and we thank you that your word declares that yes. when we decree and yes. declare God that you will establish the things oh God, God that we're praying for so Father we come into agreement yes. God even as the early church God came on one accord oh Heavenly yes. Father even as they did in Genesis 9, God, they came on one accord and you said, mm. God, that there would be nothing withheld from them, oh Heavenly yes. Father. There'd be nothing that they would imagine to do, God, that would be withheld. So we thank you that even as Jesus. we have come together on one accord, yes. God, that there is nothing, God, that we would imagine to do that mm. we cannot do, oh Heavenly Father, in your name. Where your word declares what two of us shall touch and agree concerning the things that we ask, God, that we'll have those petitions. Yes. So Father, we thank you that even as we come together on one accord, oh Heavenly Father, God, that as we stand together, yes, we will see breakthroughs. Jesus. God, that there'll be fresh oil that's released from yes. heaven, oh God. Oh God, that there's fresh strength that's released mm. from heaven, God. Glory that there are those God. who are writing books, oh God. And those books, oh God, are going to be amazing testimonies, God, of what you're going to do in the mm. lives of your people. And God, those, speak, those books will speak for us for generations to come. Jesus. Yes, and we'll have supernatural debt elimination, oh God, even as we pray, even as we, uh, oh God, even as we stand in one accord, oh Heavenly God. Father. God, we thank you, Lord God, for those who need releases in ministry. And God, those who need their homes Jesus. blessed, oh God, yes. in favor upon their children, oh God. Jesus. We declare now, God, God, that in the name of Jesus, even upon those in other nations, God, that oh, wherever, God. They are, wherever they're writing from, wherever it is that they're connecting from, Father, our prayer, God, Jesus. is that you release everything that they need, God, that they live under a perpetual open heaven, yes. oh God, yes. that, your, that your heavens will open begin to heavens. drop over them, God, that it will begin to drip, and not just drip, but mm. God, that it will begin to pour, and favor would come out when you're pouring, oh God, even as you open up the spout of heaven, God, and begin to pour out, Father, Jesus. we declare, Lord God, that yes, there is a free flow of your spirit, God, mm. over the places where they live, oh Heavenly Father, even those who are searching, even for new Jesus. church homes, God direct them, God guide their footsteps, God cause them to go into the place, oh Heavenly Father, that you call for them to be, and even every leader that's on here, God, that needs new things for their ministry, Jesus. Father, release those things that they need in the name of Jesus, God, but your word declares, God, that you would not withhold any good thing from those that walk yes. uprightly, so yes. Father, we're praying for blessing and we're praying for strength, and we're praying for open heavens, and we're praying for open doors, and we're praying for everything that they need to be released unto them in the name of Jesus, God God, don't hold Jesus. back anything that they need. God, release everything they need. Some are saying they need laborers, oh God. And some are saying, Lord God, that they need that they just need, oh God, a fresh anointing, oh yes. God. And so, God, we're praying now for a fresh anointing mm. upon them, fresh vision, God, fresh thought processes, God, new witty inventions, God, new creative ideas, oh, God, Jesus. new people to be upon their team, even cause them to have the right teams, yes. God, that would help yes. them to go forth, yes. oh, God, and do the Creativity. things that you've called for yes. them to be, oh, God, and to do. God, we thank you, God, that they'll be in the right place at the right time, oh, God, God, for divine oh, connections, God. oh, God, oh, God, divine suddenlies. And, Father, let them receive suddenly after suddenly, oh, Heavenly Jesus. Father. Yes, God, a restoration of the relationship with their siblings, oh, God. 
this man of God, God, we decree that God, even now, God, you're causing heart changes, God, and heart transplants, God, in the in the in the in the spirit realm, God, that heart transplant plants are coming to pass, oh God. Even that in the past where they were not able to get along, oh God, we're praying, God, for supernatural anointing, oh Heavenly Father, a reconciliation to be their portion, Father. Let your heavens open over their home, God. Let their oh God, let the heavens open over their relationship, God. Everywhere, God, even the sole of their foot tread, let Mm. them possess it. These people who need open doors in their jobs, God, their places of employment, are those who want to start businesses, God, begin to release it unto them in the name of Jesus, Father. Let everything that they need be released to them, God. Don't let anything be held up. Let this be the time and the season, God, that everything that they need, God, to be released, God, everything they're praying for you for, everything they're asking Mm. you for, Father, let this be the season, God, that it comes to pass. God, every person that needs healing, every person that needs deliverance, oh God, every every person that needs to be set free, oh God, let this happen now in Jesus' name, Mm. and everything again that that seems to be held up, oh God, let it, oh Heavenly Father, change, God, let the winds of change blow for them like never before, in Jesus' name, let it be so, God, we thank you, God, that you're moving on behalf of these men and women of God, God, that everything they're asking you for, God, you're moving for them, God, you're changing their hearts, you're changing their mindset, you're changing their thought process, and Father, you're releasing your glory over their lives, you're releasing, oh God, the breakthrough in every situation, God, everything they need Mm. is being released, it's being loosed, oh God, oh God, in the name of Jesus, yes, ears are being unclogged, the winds of change are blowing, oh God, God. we declare now, God, that multiple streams are flowing for Mm. them, oh God, supernatural suddenlies are coming to them in Jesus' name, amen. Glory to God. In the name of Jesus, we decree and declare, God, that they will not get weary in well-doing, but they will continue to trust in you with all of their heart, and they will not lean to their own understanding, but in all of their ways, God, they will acknowledge you, and you will certainly direct their path. I thank you, God, for the doors that you've opened that no man can close. I thank you that you've made a way in the wilderness, and you created a river in a desert place, in a dry place. In the name of Jesus, I thank you, God, that you are refreshing them. You are renewing them now. You're reviving them. You're replenishing them. Father, I thank you that you are doing what only you can do in their lives. I thank you for your supernatural grace. I thank you that you're putting super on their natural in this season. I thank you, Father God, it won't be by their power or might, but certainly by your spirit. I thank you, Father God, that you have already gone before them. You've made every crooked path straight. You've sent angels before them to prepare the way. In the name of Jesus, we decree and declare that no weapon that was formed against them will be able to prosper. No devil, no hex, no curse, no witch, no warlock in the name of Jesus will be able to stop the plans and purpose of God for your life. You are everything that God says that you are. You will do everything that God says that you will do and you will have everything that God says that you have in the name of Jesus. It has already been set in motion. Your blessing, your breakthrough, your suddenly has already been set in motion and nothing can stop it. Nothing because God is watching over his word as he has sent his word to you, as he sent his word to heal you, as he has sent his word to deliver you, as he has sent his word to restore you and everything that contains to you, your family, your sons, your daughters, your mother, your father, in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. The attack has been great upon your family, even upon your ministry and your business, but the devil is a liar. He has to flee now in Jesus name. He has to let go now in Jesus name. We decree and declare that his plots and plans and schemes are are null and void. They are of no effect in your life. In the name of Jesus, we veto it. We cancel it. We annihilate it. We cast it down. We destroy it in the name of Jesus and now it's time to build and now it's time to plant now it's time to establish now because God is sending you he's sending you forth in the name of Jesus you would testify of the goodness of God you would testify of his love and his mercy come on you will lift up the name of the Lord hallelujah and he will draw all men unto him you will truly know that God is with you and he's for you and you will be able to say hallelujah that this is the Lord's doing and it is marvelous it is marvelous in our eyes hallelujah Hallelujah, that your children are going to rise up and they will call you blessed. They will bless you. Hallelujah. Those, hallelujah, as you have raised them up in the fear and admonition of the Lord, when they are old, they will not depart from the word of God. Hallelujah. The prayers that you prayed over your family, they have to manifest. The son has to line up now in Jesus' name. He's been called by God. He's been chosen by God. And I declare he's a mighty man of valor. He's a man of strength. He's a man of honor. He's a man of courage and bravery. Now in Jesus' Jesus name. Come on. Your daughter is a woman of grace and power. Many daughters have done uh, virtuously, but she excels them all. She is everything that she says that she, that God says that she is in the name of Jesus. Your husband, we call him forth as the high priest of his home, as the king and the prophet.
and in the name of Jesus, he takes his rightful place now in Jesus name, the, the wife, I call you forth. I call you to be the wife that God has ordained you to be in the name of Jesus. I thank you that Proverbs 31 women are arising, that the Annas are arising, the Hannahs are arising now in Jesus name. Come on. It's your time. It's your season. We're calling you forth. God is calling you from the background into the forefront in the name of Jesus. He's releasing a special grace upon your life to finish the work, to finish the book, to finish the project, to finish the business plan. It's time to finish. It's time to finish what you started. God has released a finishes anointing upon you. The heavens have opened up upon you as you open up your mouth, as you lift up your voice and cry out unto God to a holy God. He will meet you at the very point of your need. Every desire, he goes beyond the need and he said, I'll give you the very desires of your heart. I will withhold nothing from you. I find pleasure in your prosperity. God wants to bless you more than you want to be blessed because his name is at stake. Come on. His name is at stake as Jehovah Jireh. His name is at stake as Jehovah Rapha, your healer. His name is at stake as Jehovah Roha, your shepherd. He's the one that's going to lead you and guide you. It's not going to be your friends. It's not going to be your family. It's going to be God that's going to lead you and guide you in the way that you should go. Hallelujah. Oh. Glory to God. His name is at stake. He is Jehovah Nisi. I know the enemy came and he tried you. I know he tried to stop you. I know he tried to discourage you. The devil is a liar. You will not walk in discouragement. Hallelujah. But you will walk in power. You will walk in boldness. You will walk in courage. You will walk in the ways of God and you will do what God has called you to do in this season. You will not fear because God has not given you the spirit of fear. Therefore, you will not fear man. What man can do to you because because you know if it, because God is for you and God is with you because sometimes people can be with you but they won't be for you but when God is for you he's also with you mm. in Jesus name and it shall surely come, come to, to pass God. hallelujah hallelujah, hallelujah. Glory to your name, Jesus. Glory to your name, God. We have your way today, God. Have your way. God, we thank you for God encounters. We thank you for the supernatural manifesting that we walk in the supernatural, that it becomes our new normal. Oh, God, mm -hmm. suddenly becomes our new normal. Breakthrough becomes our new normal. God, that we can walk in the mm -hmm. place of love. We can Baby, walk in forgiveness. Yes. We can walk in favor. And that is our new normal. It is what happens to us on a daily basis. It's not something just once a year or twice a year but every single day we walk in the perpetual blessing of the Lord because the blessings are overtaking us. As we seek God, his blessings will seek us. As we continue to seek him, his blessings will overtake us in Jesus name. Hallelujah. In Jesus name. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Yes, yes, Amen. yes. Come on, it's time to praise him. That's right. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. It's time to praise him because you know it's already done. It's finished. It's complete. In Jesus' name, God doesn't just start something. He finishes at the same time. Everything Amen. Starts. Everything, everything. He, fit, he starts it and finishes at the same time because he is God. He's Alpha and Omega at the same time. Amen. Hallelujah walking in power. Yes, you're walking in the ways of God. You're walking as, as, as God has ordained for you to walk in, in Jesus name. And, and there are some times where, where you feel that God, okay, God, you have not uh, really manifested or it doesn't seem like it's going the way that you initially thought. But if you trust God, if you know that God is in full control of every situation and every circumstance, you have to know that it has to work together for, for your good. good. That's it. That's because it. what? You love God and you're mm. called according to his purpose. So what you're dealing with is according to his purpose. What you've endured is according to his purpose. It all has purpose. The pain has purpose. The, the craziness had purpose. The mess has purpose in mm. Jesus name. It all has purpose. Amen. So it has to work together. And let me tell you, sometimes we got to make our trials pay us. We have to make our tribulations pay us. Amen. It's payback time. Yes. It's, it's payback time. Come on. It's payback time. Make the devil pay you for every heartache, for everything that he sent against you. Every, every time he tried to cause you to be depressed and, 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 and to look back and, and to feel that God was not with you every single time, make him pay. Amen. Mm, yes. 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 Restitu restoration yes. and restitution. restitution. Amen. Right. He doesn't just have to pay back. He has to restore sevenfold. That's it. Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. Come on. You got to make him pay. You got to make sure your trial pays you. Hmm. Glory to your name. Your, your trial owes you something. 
Amen. It owes you some peace. It owes you some stability. It owes you something. Mm, yes. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Yes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yes, Glory mm -hmm. to God. Glory to God. Mm -hmm. Yes. Purpose. Purpose is calling you. Purpose is calling you. Hallelujah, Jesus. Mm. Mm. How many people, how many people received Glory that tonight? To God. How many people Glory received to that tonight? Amen. Yes, How many people Lord. receive that yes. God is opening My the heavens, God. causing the Come heavens on. to drip and to My drop God. over you, Glory. amen, and, is, and then Glory. now the enemy is having to repay for you because mm. your enemy, <laughs> amen, the Bible said, let, let God arise and let his enemies, enemies be, scattered. be scattered. And so your enemy, amen, your enemy of poverty or debt or, or, or not being reconciled with people, amen, that that is the enemy of God and right. God is chasing your enemies away. Jesus. He's chasing them. He's causing them to flee. And if he's My causing God. them to flee, what he is then causing in the heavens to drop down over you. Mm. Amen. Mm. That's why he had to get the enemy to flee because right. he didn't want the enemy to be there to receive the same My blessing God. that you got. Absolutely. He had to Absolutely. get your enemy up out of there. Because when you see your enemies, you better look for your table because God is preparing a table before you in the very presence of your enemies. They will see you eat, but they won't be able to partake of it in Jesus name. Mm. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. <laughs> get your fork out. Get your knife out. Get your napkin out. Amen. You're about to enjoy a five-course meal in the name of Jesus. Mm. That's mm. it. That's it. That's <laughs> it. Get ready. Ooh. Get ready. Glory to Praise God. The Lord. Healing and restoration and marriages and relationships mm -hmm. in Jesus' name. Your family is about to sit down at the table. Ah, glory. glory to your name. Yes, I feel and it. eat in the presence of God. You're going to rejoice in the presence of God. Glory to God. Come on, call your family together. It's time to bring your family together because God is restoring in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. In Jesus' name. Yeah. Hallelujah. Somebody say, I hear the, hear the sound of their payback. Amen. Yes, come on. Hallelujah. Yes, yes. Hallelujah. My God. Yes. yes. I'm waiting on the testimonies to come falling, to, to come running mm. in. Amen. I'm looking for the testimonies. Yes. Hallelujah. Glory to Somebody God. said if they, if they could scream, they would. Amen. Well, <laughs> go, go ahead and shout now. Go ahead and shout now. Because the victory is oh yours. Oh, my God. You, mm -hmm. <laughs> you can put an advance praise on that because it's already done. Make Amen. a payback suddenly. I like yes. that. Yes. Amen. Yes. Restitution it's, it's is on its way. Amen. Amen. Your trials got to pay you. <laughs> Come on, Roosevelt Rogers. You better prophesy, man. Ooh, Jesus. Michelle My J. Miller, I see you. Lord, I see. Jesus of Nazareth. Jesus. Alvin Jackson, get ready. Son of the living God. Get ready, Alvin Jackson. Mm. Karen Belcher. Jesus. My daddy's girl. Come My on, get God. ready. Yes, come on. Y'all get Mega ready. God is getting ready to do it. Amber yes, Thomas. Yes, get marriage. ready. Aisha Bowden, get yes. ready. Crystal Henry, yes. get ready. Come on. Hallelujah. Jack Nadir Willard. Alexander, get yes. ready. Yes. Hallelujah. Tori, Michelle J. Miller, you better mm. get ready. Yes, God. You better get Jesus. Natasha Rogers, get ready. Get come ready. On. Amen. Get ready. Everybody that's on Build here, get ready for God to do amazing things. It's your season. Ooh, it's your time. Jesus, I may not have called out your name. Amen. But God knows it's your, your name. name. Absolutely. Andrew Richardson. Amen. Yes. Javette Bowers. My God. Amen. I'm telling you. Amen. God is going to do amazing mm, things for you. Jesus. Get ready to receive what I God has for you. I can't even read them. They're coming up so fast. But we're oh, decreeing. Gosh, amen. Yes, sight. it is a harvest oh, for you. Amen. Come on. Just put that up. It's my suddenly season. Amen. It's my suddenly season. My God. Let the heavens drip my over God. me. Let the heavens Jesus. drop over me. Mm. Let the heavens overflow in my life. Lord, Amen. It's my it's Jesus. my it's my suddenly season. Yes. And yes. let the heavens drop. Amen. Jesus. Let them drop over drop. my life. Let the favor of God drop over my me. God. Let the strength of God. Jesus. Let the wisdom of God. Mm. Let reconciliation drop. Let restitution drop. Yes. Amen. Let it all drop over me. It's my suddenly season. season. Amen. And God is getting ready. I'm telling you, I feel it. I Mama know it. I know that God saying. has not called us all to come here to together mm. and be on one accord be of one mind My and he's God. not going to do it amen so when you when you wake up in the morning you wake up when you go to bed tonight you wake up and you declare it's my suddenly season yes, when you yes. wake up in the morning you declare Jesus. it's my suddenly season amen when you when you wake up when <laughs> you go to bed everything that pertains Glory to you to says it's my suddenly season yes. amen i'm telling you that the heavens are dropping Lord, over you amen, amen. that it is dropping Lord, over you amen Lord, that it is dropping over you mm, you got to decree mm, that declare mm, it and believe mm, it and trust that god is 
doing it that it is your suddenly season yes, it and is. that the heavens are it open is. over you live under a perpetual My open God, heaven yes. amen and yes it is your mega season of mm. suddenly overflow suddenly yes. season amen that God, God is releasing the mega over you <laughs> he's releasing it big it's Ooh. not just going to be small it's going to be huge amen yes a thousand times a thousand My God. amen millions are dropping over you Jesus. amen the heavens are dropping the mm. heavens are open over you we decreed it and we declared it we've stood in agreement for it and God is doing it for you he is doing it for My you God. There is not any good thing, amen, that you should desire, amen, that God is not yes. opening for you, amen, yes. sickness and, and death and spiritual uh, and, 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 and even everything, God, that God is opening for oh, you God. because this is Jesus. why Jesus went to the cross and died for us, amen. It's a part of the package of salvation, yes, amen. It's a it part is. of your benefits yes. package, amen, but that God not. begins to open up these benefits to mm. you, that he opens up things to you. This is your suddenly season and you got to receive that. You got to know that God is opening the heavens <laughs> over your life and causing Ooh. them to flow like Jesus. never before. Amen. Yes, let, it's my suddenly it's season mine. and let it's the heavens mine. drop over me. It's Amen. Mine. The heavens are dropping over me. That's your declaration. When you yes. open up your mouth, yes. the heavens are dropping over me. It's mm. my suddenly season. Amen. 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 You know, one of the things that um, the Lord was just saying. Allison, was, I see you. Carlise, I see you. Yes. It's that when God releases and when you receive it and you take hold of it, God said you're going to, uh, he's going to allow you to even bring forth and help bring forth a suddenly season for somebody else. When God releases and opens up and the heavens drop, it's going to be more than enough for you. Amen. It, it's going to be more than enough. And so you're going to be able to be a catalyst for somebody else. You're going to be able to stand in the gap with them. You're going to be able to encourage them and to push them into that place that they receive there suddenly as well. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Well, Glory listen, to we're going to, we're going to be, we're going to continue to do the one o'clock scopes and the midnight scopes. But I think sometime in the afternoon, we're going to do a, uh, we're going to do a, a, a live uh, message inside of the group. So everybody that's, that signed up for the group, we're going to start this week, uh, probably sometime in the afternoon, in the evening, uh, we're going to begin to do a, uh, do a, 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 uh, what is it? A um, just a live video inside yes. the group in the evenings, amen. So we can minister personally to you guys that have signed up for the group. I think we almost have about 600 people in that group in about the last four days, amen. Mm -hmm. And so somebody asked what group. There is a group on Facebook, and it's called "It's My Suddenly Season." Yes. And so in that, we're doing testimonies and we're doing uh, prayer requests. So you can put your prayer requests in there. Uh, how do you sign up? You just go to uh, "It's My Suddenly Season." And uh, when you go to It's My Suddenly Season and the groups on Facebook, they'll, they'll, uh, you know, somebody will let you in. Amen. Yes. And so we're excited because we want to really minister to you. We want to build mm. up your faith. Uh, hopefully this in a couple of, couple of days that, that uh, Faith CD we're doing, we're finishing it up on this week. And so I'm telling you that I really believe that God is going to open up the heavens over you as your Jesus. faith increases. Let me tell you something. There is something that happens when your faith increases. Yes. We're coming, even we're coming to many cities around the U.S. We, we've already launched. Uh, Locked in Oakland, California, uh, uh, Indianapolis, Indiana, uh, and then after Indianapolis, I think it's Atlanta. Uh, we've already locked in a meeting in Perth, Australia, and mm. Trinidad. Yes. Amen. And uh, and so just amazing things. Jesus. Let me give you two, a couple other things that, that are going on right now. Uh, number one, our Discipleship Institute is, um, uh, somebody said, yes, you can send the pictures in the group. Our Discipleship yeah. Institute uh, is actually starting not this Monday, but the next Monday. Mm -hmm. Amen. Our, our, um, our Discipleship Institute will be starting. Yes, we'll be in, uh, in Quincy, Florida with the Stalwarts. Amen. Yes. On Friday, Saturday. <laughs> and, uh, and we'll be there uh, Sunday. Amen. We're going to come in and go hang out with them for a minute. Amen. And so uh, God is doing some amazing things. But yes, yes. Atlanta. Yes. Uh, yes, Tampa. Yes, uh, Oakland, California. My yes God. to Indianapolis and Trinidad and also, uh, help me out, Australia, Australia Perth, Australia. Perth, yes. And then somebody called us today and said they wanted us to come to um, they wanted us to come to Connecticut, Connecticut so we're looking there, and then also Boston, amen? And uh, so we're looking at some amazing things. We're going to be in Alabama in, uh, we're going to be in Alabama in June. June. I think it's the second mm -hmm. week in June. We're going to be yes. in Huntsville doing a gladiator camp. And so, yes, we're coming to Boston, and so we're excited. We're looking to go and be in your city because we believe that there is something that God has released Jesus. on us uh, and is going to do amazing things. He's going to do amazing things through Jesus. us and by us and for us. And then it's not just about us, but when we come together My corporately, God. we're going to see yes. God do amazing things. Amazing amen. Things. We believe God for the amazing. Amen. 
Hallelujah. Yes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yes. Undercover so we're blessing. I love that. I, like I that, love huh? that. Yes. Yes. Hallelujah. That's, That's right. what God is positioning you for. He's positioning, He's healing you so that you can become the healer. He's delivering you so that you can help deliver someone else. Amen. Because you'll understand um, what it means and what it feels like to be in bondage, to be in a place of lack of not enough or almost enough. And so God is calling you and He's positioning you as He's as you're being postured, amen, as you're being propelled is you being placed um, in, in an open heaven that God will release such an amazing things over your life because he wants you to therefore now become a blessing um, to many others, to the world, amen, to the world. Amen. Well, listen, yes. again, those that want to connect with the, our Discipleship Institute, what we're going to be teaching and training, I would love for you to be able to, uh, to sign up. You can learn more about it at www.discipleshipinstitute.org. Uh, uh, Amen. And then for those of you who want to connect with our ministry, you can go to uh, www.lejean, amen, and valora.com. Again, that's lejean and valora.com. Uh, I'm going to try to get some sleep tonight, but if you need to call us, you can do 1-844-WE, that's W-E, the letter R, and C-O-L-E, amen, yes. 1-844-WE-R-COLE, and we yes. usually answer that, I have somebody answer for people to be able to pray with, if you're having troubles with the order or something else, uh, then I want to make sure, yes, it is an online class, amen, yes. it is an online class. And um, we want to be a blessing to people. We want to help people. Amen. We want to help to see people fulfill the destinies that God has upon mm -hmm. their lives. Amen. So we're yes. looking forward to connecting with you. Uh, we, we talk to a lot. A lot of times people call and they just call just to say hello, say God bless you. And uh, usually we're in the, when we're in the office, we always connect with people and love on people. Yes. Amen. So yes. uh, we're excited. Amen. <laughs> call me tomorrow. If you said if I have not received my shirt, then make sure that you call us tomorrow. one 844 we, we are cold. cold. Amen. W E, the letter R, and then C O L E. Thank you for those who have been on these midnight cries. We're going to continue to do it. God has given us the strength to continue. Mm -hmm. So we thank God for you. Yes, Amen. Your thank prayers you. help us to continue. Hallelujah. It is your Amen. prayers, it is your faithfulness um, that helps us to continue, that gives us strength. Amen. To be able to be a blessing to you. Amen. So one o'clock tomorrow. We're excited. Yes. Amen. And, and those of you who have not joined the Facebook group, we appreciate you for being here. We 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 thank a sudden explosion. Yes. yes. Oh God. It's. Yes, yes, yes. Well, in, inside the group, we're going to ask you, those that are in the group already, I want you to think about uh, about maybe five people that you think could be a blessing to, to that, that you could, you know, that could be a blessing to be in the group. Amen. If the ministry has blessed you, then I would love for you to invite five other people, yes. at least five people apiece, amen, that you could invite into the group that you think it's going to be a blessing to. And uh, we're excited. Amen. We're excited. We're excited. We're excited. And uh, how many people would do that for us? Amen. I, I don't know where we're going to be at in Connecticut yet, but uh, would you, would you, if you're in the group, the name of the group is Lejean. I mean, no, it's uh, the name of the group is, it's, it's my, my suddenly season. It's the same name as the book. Amen. It's my suddenly season. And um, so, yes, here's the book. It's my suddenly season. So it's the same name as the book. Amen. It's my suddenly season. Uh, can we invite from the group as invite from the group as members? Yes, you can. Yes. And, uh, Yes, you sure can. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. All right. Yeah. I'm excited. We're excited. Yes. We love you. We thank yeah. God for you. And uh, it's your suddenly season. It We're getting is. out of here. It we love is. you. And we'll talk to you tomorrow. All bye -bye. right. Bye-bye. Love you guys.